Describe a person who likes to read a lot. You should say who this person is, how you knew him or her, what he she likes to read, and explain why you think he or she likes to read a lot. Describe a person who likes to read. Total time frame, 2 minutes. Introduction, 15 seconds. Who this person is, 20 seconds. How you knew him or her, 20 seconds. What he she likes to read, 25 seconds. Why you think he she likes to read a lot, 25 seconds. Conclusion, 15 seconds. Introduction, 0 to 15 seconds. Suggested ideas. Briefly introduce the topic. Avid reader. Fond of reading. Intellectual. Mention that this person is someone important in your life. Significant figure, close friend, family member. State your overall impression of their love for reading. Deep appreciation for books. Insatiable curiosity. Knowledge seeker. Example. I'd like to talk about my uncle, who is an avid reader and someone I admire for his intellectual curiosity. He has always been a significant figure in my life, and I've always been fascinated by his deep appreciation for books. Who this person is, 15 to 35 seconds. Suggested ideas. Describe their personality or profession. Thoughtful, academic, insightful. Explain their background or connection to reading. Scholarly background, lifelong learner, professional knowledge. Mention a specific trait related to their reading habits. Well-read, knowledgeable, broad-minded. Example, my uncle, a university professor, is incredibly thoughtful and insightful, always eager to expand his knowledge. His professional background in literature has naturally cultivated his love for reading, and he's known to be well-read, with a particular interest in history and philosophy. How you knew him, her, 35 to 55 seconds. Suggested ideas. Share how you first met or connected with this person. Family, childhood, long-standing relationship. Mention any early experiences with their reading habits. Early memories, moments spent reading, shared book discussions. Highlight an experience that shows their love for reading. Reading habits, book recommendations, influence on your own reading. Example, I've known my uncle my entire life, as he's a close family member. From a young age, I remember watching him read for hours in his study, surrounded by shelves filled with books. He would often recommend books to me, sparking my own love for reading. What he she likes to read, 55 to 80 seconds. Suggested ideas. Specify the genres they enjoy. Historical fiction, nonfiction, classics. Mention any favorite authors or books. Dostoevsky, biographies, science fiction. Explain why they are drawn to these types of books. Intellectually stimulating informative, engaging. Example, he enjoys reading a wide range of genres with a particular focus on historical fiction and biographies. His favorite author is Fyodor Dostoevsky, whose deep psychological insights he finds fascinating. Additionally, he reads a lot of nonfiction books, especially those that explore scientific discoveries and world history. Why you think he she likes to read a lot? 80 to 105 seconds. Suggested ideas. Explain what motivates their reading habits. Intellectual curiosity. Desire for knowledge. Passion for learning. Mention the benefits they get from reading. Mental stimulation. Expanding horizons, gaining perspectives, 
Highlight how reading affects our personality or life. Calm demeanor. Wise, thoughtful decision-making. Example, I believe my uncle reads so much because he has an insatiable curiosity and a deep desire for knowledge. Reading provides him with mental stimulation and allows him to view the world through different perspectives. This love for books has made him a more thoughtful, well-rounded individual who is always ready to engage in meaningful discussions. Conclusion 105 to 120 minutes Suggested ideas Summarize your thoughts on their love for reading. Enduring passion, impressive knowledge, valuable trait. Mention how this has influenced or inspired you. Inspiration, role model motivation. End with a final thought on the importance of reading in their life. Integral part of life, constant companion, lifelong pursuit. Example, in conclusion, my uncle's enduring passion for reading has not only shaped his impressive knowledge, but also inspired me to be more curious and thoughtful. For him, reading is a constant companion and a lifelong pursuit that has enriched his life in countless ways. I'd like to talk about my uncle, a passionate reader who inspires me with his love for books. He's someone I admire not only for his intellectual curiosity, but also for his constant pursuit of knowledge. His role in my life is significant, and I've always been fascinated by his deep appreciation for literature. My uncle is a university professor with a background in literature, which naturally cultivated his love for reading. He's incredibly insightful and well-read, especially in subjects like history and philosophy. His thoughtful nature and academic life have made him a truly intellectual person who seeks to expand his understanding of the world. I've known him my whole life, and some of my earliest memories include watching him read for hours in his study. He would often recommend books to me, sparking my own interest in reading. Those moments of discussing books together were some of the most influential experiences for me. When it comes to what he reads, he enjoys historical fiction and biographies, with Dostoevsky being one of his favorite authors. In addition to fiction, he reads nonfiction books about scientific discoveries and philosophical ideas, which he finds both stimulating and enriching. I believe my uncle's love for reading comes from his desire for knowledge and mental stimulation. Reading helps him see the world from different perspectives and has made him a wise, well-rounded person. It's clear that his passion for books has enriched his life in many ways. To conclude, my uncle's love for reading has inspired me and shaped his intellectual and personal growth. For him, reading is a lifelong pursuit that has profoundly influenced his perspective on life. Phrases from the sample. 1. Passionate Reader 2. Intellectual curiosity. 3. Constant pursuit of knowledge. 4. Significant role. 5. Deep appreciation for literature. 6. University professor. 7. Background in literature. 8. Intellectual person. 9. Well-read. 10. Insightful. 11. Thoughtful nature. 12. Academic life. 13. Expand understanding. 14. Earliest memories. 15. Watching him read. 16. Sparking my interest. 17. Influential experiences. 18. 
historical fiction. 19. Biographies. 20. Favorite authors. 21. Scientific discoveries. 22. Philosophical ideas. 23. Stimulating. 24. Enriching. 25. Desire for knowledge. 26. Mental stimulation. 27. Different perspectives. 28. Wise individual. 29. Well-rounded. 30. Lifelong pursuit. 31. Profoundly influenced. 32. Knowledgeable. 33. Cultural enrichment. 34. Intellectual growth. 35. Invaluable lessons. 36. Engaging with texts. 37. Enhancing comprehension. 38. Divergent. 39. In-depth analysis. 40. Scholarly articles. 41. Critical thinking. 42. Textual evidence. 43. Historical context. 44. Analytical skills. 45. Reflective reading. 46. Research findings. 47. Intellectual engagement. 48. Thought-provoking. 49. Theoretical frameworks. 50. Conceptual understanding. 51. Methodological approaches. 52. Systematic review. 53. Critical evaluation. 54. Scholarly discourse. 55. Interdisciplinary studies. 56. Empirical evidence. 57. Research methodology. 58. Analytical approach. 59. Academic achievement. 60. Scholarly resources. Thank you.